Hi everyone, I'm here with Ben Britt and Diaz uh, for a fan Q&A. Ben, first question, uh, when did you come to the decision that you wanted to play for Chile and do you prefer Chile or England? <laughs> um, so when I made the decision, in my, in, my, in my head when I was younger, I've always known my mum was Chile, obviously, um, from Chile. So definitely that England-Chile split in the family. One was uh, supporting Chile at the World Cup when I was younger, one was supporting England and stuff like that. But, uh, but no, a couple of seasons ago they asked me to, if I have any interest in playing for Chile and there was no hesitation from my side. I, it's a great country, great players, great team. So for me it was uh, a no-brainer. I made a decision with my family and, uh, and yeah, I've never looked back. It's been an amazing experience and it's great to, to go over there and, and play with them, yeah. <laughs> and do you prefer Chile or England? 50-50? And, yeah, uh, you can like Chile. both. Chile? Yeah, yeah. He's going Chile. for Chile. 100%. Right. Um, best mate in the Chilean national team? Um, best mate, Francesco Serralta. He plays for Watford. Yeah. He's me and him, we share rooms together. Um, and Paulo Diaz, he uh, plays at River Plate. So, oh, what's it like when you come up against Serralta? Have you done that yet this yeah, season? Yeah, we've played against him a few times. You know, he's an aggressive centre half. Uh, he likes to put a tackle in there, but we get on very well and he speaks good English, so uh, we get on good. What's your favourite Chilean word? Chilean word? Uh, well, there's some words I can't say. <laughs> but all the lads tell me bad words, so but I can't say them. So, favourite word? I like empanadas because they're good. They're, they're nice to eat as well. So, that's my favourite word. Next one. Oh, can you speak Spanish? I mean, how well can you speak Spanish? You're learning, not, aren't you? Yeah, not very well. I, not very well. I couldn't. I can't give you anything here, but not, I, do, I do lessons, and I could. I understand more than I can say if that yeah. makes sense. But sometimes to put it in a sentence is, is hard. But I'll, I'll get there. You know empanadas at least. Yeah. You don't need any more than that <laughs> sometimes. Um, what are your challenges both with the Chilean team, and what does the future hold for you at club level? Will you continue in England, or will you see as the months go by? I think that's just a roundabout way of asking about your future. <laughs> yeah. Uh, well, obviously, for the um, we've got the Copa America coming up, and the, the next World Cup after this. So, obviously, win games and, and getting a good position for both the tournaments, and uh, try get more appearances when I get called up. Um, so, yeah. And the other, one, the other one was? The other one, what does the future hold for you at club level? Will you continue in England or will you see as the months go by? Uh, I couldn't tell you yet. You know, I'm here at Rovers enjoying myself. So. Fair yeah. enough. We'll <laughs> let you away with that one. Uh, who is your footballing idol? Footballing idol. When I was young, I used to love watching Wayne Rooney and uh, Thierry Henry. Any Chileans? Uh, obviously, Sanchez when he was at United, yeah. Arsenal, stuff like that. Definitely in Barcelona. So. Definitely watch them quite a bit. Would you rather win the World Cup with Chile or the Champions League with Blackburn? Uh, I think it's got to be win the World Cup with Chile. <laughs> What's more likely, do you think? <laughs> <laughs> no comment. <laughs> uh, best Chilean food? Best Chilean food. Empanadas, my favourite food. We get there after the game, the, the chef makes us uh, empanadas after the game. so. They're good. Is it so a completely different kind of food that you get at Blackburn then? Yeah, yeah. We, over in Chile, it's more like your steaks and stuff like that, and it's, it's lovely food. I love food over there, and uh, the empanadas is kind of like a, a pastry, a little treat after the game, so it's nice. Uh, right, this is a bit of a random one. It just says yerba mate, which is a, a, a tea. herbal tea. Yeah. 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 Uh, do you like corgis? <laughs> So that's all one question. <laughs> so let's deal with Yerba Mate first. Um, so most, not most, but a lot of the boys in Chile do the, the mate, the little the herbs in a, in, a, in a cup things. But I've tried it, it's not for me. So, so yeah, it, it doesn't really taste that nice, but all the boys love it over there and it's something that they do. And uh, it, it looks cool in a little bag and they walk around with it, but it's not for me. And do you like corgis? <laughs> I don't know what they are. <laughs> Little dogs that the, the Queen oh, used to have. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. No, I like. You I've into got, dogs? Have you got a yeah, dog? Yeah. I've got a dog myself, uh, a cockapoo. His little little thing is cute. I've only got him a year ago, but but no, it's good. I like I like dogs. I didn't I didn't like dogs, but then we got one. Me and my missus did, and uh, I love it now. Yeah. So you need to do a bit of research into corgis. Yeah. No, I know now. I know. The, uh, the uh, what career would you like if football didn't exist? I'm not quite sure. It's all I've ever known is. Is football, football you know? Football, eh? 
my, my dad would love football. He used to bring me up. He used to go play football. So I couldn't, re I couldn't really answer that. I don't really know. All I'm known is football. So yeah. Uh, who does your family support? What in well, which team? Yeah. You're from Stoke. Well, I'm from Trent, Stoke. So yeah. I do. I do. Me and my dad. We support. I support Stoke. That's where I'm from, and I used to always I, I see the ticket there, and uh, when we call the followers there, uh, Sidibe and that, um, Roy the Lap. So yeah, I used to always have a season ticket there and go watch them. So that was amazing. So yeah, I support Stoke. My dad supports Stoke. Uh, so yeah. Isn't he the match commander at Stoke? Your dad's a policeman, isn't yeah, he? Yeah, he's no, he's in charge uh, of the police operation yeah, he's, there. he's top dog, isn't he? So he does. Uh, <laughs> He does the, um, the police and stuff at, at Stoke and stuff like that, so, so yeah. And you've had some good results at Stoke as well, scored against them there. What's, what's it like playing away at Stoke? Yeah, yeah, no, when I always play Stoke, I always love it, you know, because people, when I say people I support Stoke, they're like, oh, you don't want to win, you don't want to score, but I feel like I want to score even more, you know, against a team <laughs> that you, your support would be a great a great thing to talk about. So, so yeah, when I play them, it's always a, it's a good experience and a good moment for myself, yeah. You're not worried about upsetting your family and your mates? No, definitely not. When, I'm, when I play against Stoke, all my family are supporting Rovers, so... <laughs> Fair enough. Uh, what's one change you'd make in football? One change... One change. The offside rules, so I can just stand offside all game and just put it in the just goal. No offside? <laughs> yeah. How many did you get? 100 a season? <laughs> um, another random one. I don't know if you're a gardener, are you? Gardener, no. How do I get my geraniums to grow bigger? Water them, I don't know. That'll do, water them. <laughs> Can anyone tell the difference between you and Bradley Dack? <laughs> I know, me and Dax get that a lot, you know. <laughs> we're both good-looking guys, so uh, Obviously. we get it quite a lot. There is a height difference, though, isn't yeah, there? Yeah, there is a height difference, so you should know. <laughs> he comes up to my shoulders, so you should know. Do you get mixed up a lot? I mean, do you go out nah. together very much? Uh, no, he's all famous now, isn't he? He's on TV and that, <laughs> yeah. doing the show with, he, with Olivia and his missus. So, <laughs> so now he's, uh, he gets all the attention. Last one, a bit of a naughty one, really. If you could join any team in the world, who would it be? Uh, it's got to be uh, my boy club, Stoke. <laughs> <laughs> really? Yeah. Nah, Stoke. It's I, achievable. I, yeah, yeah, I used to play for him and I, I love I support Stoke, you know, so it'd be great. So maybe at some point in your career, obviously not in the near future, <laughs> but maybe somewhere down the line maybe. you might fancy playing for Stoke. Maybe. Or in Chile. I, like, I would like to play in Chile when I'm older. Yeah. Maybe. It'd be a good experience with my family and that over there, so that would be nice as well. Excellent. Thank, Thank you. you for your time. Thank Cheers. You very much. Great Appreciate stuff. It. Cheers. Thank you.